The boy pressed the other boy's head into the water, and didn't let go for a long time. He didn't let go until the boy was dying. Jack was gasping for air. As he walks towards the shore, the boy suddenly throws his binoculars, which belonged to his roommate's dead father, into the lake. Jack finally couldn't help but explode, swinging to get the boy, then rushed to the lake to retrieve them. But the lake is so big, he did not find the binoculars. Jack returns to the shore in disappointment, only to find the boy lying motionless. Jack was so scared that he thought he had killed someone. He grabbed his clothes and ran like crazy. Halfway there, he suddenly calmed down. He couldn't leave in such a hurry, so he went back to the lake, but the boy was gone. As darkness fell, Jack walked through the woods alone. He didn't dare to go back to the orphanage, so he found a roadside to rest for the night. Early the next morning, he drank some water from the toilet and ate a meal with the only change he had left. Jack walked all the way home, but no one was there. The keys weren't in his shoes, and there was no note from his mom in the organizer. 